uh, what was the plan? Finally, continuing here. The judge has to block back. Magic attack. Heavy attack. Jump. Dodge. Triangles for that. Just switching. All right, I believe I'm ready now. Okay, we were there. We got a thing to do. Uh, but I first want to finish. Underground boss, and there's one I still need to get here. No, that's not a, this is the location I still need to get here. Not that one. I think that one is completed, and this one is completed. Yeah, as far as I'm there from today. This is the location. Alright. I need to find the bastard who called me made in this. There, that's him. Alright, so let's put a marker there. Finally discovered a way to get the dude I wanted to get. Uh just double check. Because I've done one of the things and then... So pleased you're here. I'm glad that you're enjoying my gift. Hmm. I knew it from the view. You have a taste for noble blood. <clears throat> I wish to anoint you a proper inductee. A knight to serve Luminary Mo, the Lord of Blood, and establish a new dynasty. Luminary Mo has strength, vision, and of course, love. So, what do you say, my lambkin? Yeah. <laughs> 
who would have it any other way? Now, take this. Okay. For your final trial, soak the cloth with a maiden's blood. Normally, this ritual would involve killing one's own maiden and recanting the wisdom of the two fingers. But since you are maidenless, the blood of anyone's maiden will do. The cloth is your final trial. Soak it with the blood of a maiden. The blood of anyone's maiden will do. You are maidenless, after all. Okay, let me just read this article again. I believe they said where to find the maiden. Chamber find a speak to there in front of the entrance of Rose Church. It's a very useful to do things that didn't seem right. Use three festering blood fingers. Return to Varian and Rose Church and choose a ninth night. Moch, go to Elden Ring Church of Inhibitions. Don't need to find a dead maiden. Go to Elden Ring Church of Inhibitions. Ugh. Of innovation there. In terms of that, I was to. Wait. I was going to find a dead maiden sitting on a chair. Haha, hello. -ha. Oh. That pain in the ass in that corner. I still have to freak the three Christian sisters. You've completed your final trial, and with this, you are a formal inductee, a knight who will assist Luminary Moog, Lord of Blood, in the establishment of a new dynasty. Now, give me your finger. This noble blood will be an immutable badge of honor once it settles inside of you. No clue what he just said because I just got interrupted. As far as I know, I'm going to probably give my finger. Oh, heavens. Clench your teeth or something. Oh. Never forget that feeling of agony, for it is what binds you to Luminary Moog, to all of us. <laughs> 
You're anointed as a knight of Mahvoda, but I will then give you a piece of white fabric. My lambkin. White fabric, I will in the mission, eliminate dead men in the chair, then for the button, prompt to die the cloth in the maiden blood, as is on the to you. You actually outline our section below. Go back to the end of the rest and I officially name you a knight of Mahvoda. However, the next bit is pretty um, but necessary to follow complete the quest. Follow the bottom prompt to offer your finger to Var so that he can cut it off. Keep talking to him afterwards to get all your rewards for honoring the request line, which we've mentioned in a little further below. Mr. of inhibition is incredibly hard, mainly because there's a tower nearby. Yeah, okay, yeah, that I've done. A medal granted by the new Mogwin dynasty. With the power to grant audience, I've gone out of my way to provide one to you. But you mustn't use it just yet. The meeting must wait until the Mogwin dynasty commences. Luminary Mog yet slumbers beside the divinity. We must endure a little longer. Ah, it is trying. But we must be patient. One day you will be elevated, deservedly. But right, my lambkin? <laughs> ah, it is trying. But we one day you will. Right, my lambkin? <laughs> ah, one day you. Right, my lambkin? <laughs> Found each other looking great, like guys make on the map below for it. Well, you reached the ground left of deck, and you probably won't know how to use this yet, but you put together a guy how to use the ground left of deck. Then you head to the left of north and go off to the southeast, where there's a slope rising off the right cliff. You'll be able to see the madness inflicting frenzy flaming tower with its deadly. Letting Vi cut off your finger, he'll give you Eldenaring Blood Finger in a turn. An item functions exactly like the Festering Blood Finger, except it never consumed, allowing you to invade infinitely. Keep talking to Vi afterwards, and he'll also give you a Pure Blood Knight's Medal that will allow you to get an audience with Moch when you use this item from your inventory. It will teleport you to, to Moch Wayne Palace. A very high level area that is technically under scaled where you can clash with Moch in a boss fight. Only other way to access this area is through the portal in the very late game stage of Elden Ring. Uh, okay, wait, hold on.
I'm looking like my ass. And that will not get an audience of more. Reaver here. The Grim Reaper needs a break. There is something I'd like to say. My purpose was given to me by my mother, but now I act of my own volition. I have set my heart upon the world that I would have, regardless of my mother's designs. I won't allow anyone to speak ill of that. Not even you. Why did I remove your frost again? Oh yeah, I needed to remove your frost to put fire on you.
Alright, yeah, that's good. Okay, I think before we press on, we're gonna stop it here. There's one more thing I need to actually make this thing all powerful. damage each other? What the hell? Oh, that one was still slowly dying. Poison damage? He taking poison damage? It doesn't look like he's dying of poison. Yeah, how do you roll all the way of that thing in time? I don't think that's the way down. this to the next point they don't pause this video oh that kills them instantly that's suicide seen at the next bonfire.
I'm gonna get the eye socket. Oh, that's a headshot. And, oh, hello. I'd like to finish the underground bosses, but you guys are giving me some XP to grind. Uh, that one up front just suicided. <laughs> oh, what's up? So yeah, he, he's not. He, he, he wants no part in this. That's not an underground boss, as far as I know, the bosses are around here. That's not him, him, shill. So I'm gonna avoid that one for now. And, oh, hello. just happened. Okay, I didn't do shit to, uh, to that big slime thing up top. There we go. Nice in the head. In the throat. A miss. And hit the slime at least. And who said the Grim Reaper doesn't use a bow? side of the skull. That one down in the chest. That one in the shoulder. That's okay, apparently a hit. That shoulder and let's go with a headshot. Another throat. Okay, apparently that's miss. There we go.
Yeah, okay. It's maybe not like the best weapon to fight these guys with, seeing as blood loss picks up. But it works! Okay, can you just die? Thank you. Now your friend back there. He should be dead before he reaches me. Maybe not. The Reaper demands you to die! Thank you. Took your sweet bloody time. All of your cattle baptizing our crimson. not want to sustain the poison, you get executed. Oh, no, he survived the execution, okay. Now you die. Whack, whack, roll away. He's even praying in his death. How proud. You must really be a man of the Lord. Rolling away. Rolling away. I might have some fun with you. Bye, Larry. Blood rose. Oh shit, Larry fell off. He went kabooey and went down. I think I'm going down. Alright, anyway, I think I'm gonna pause it here with you. I gotta go do something. Uh, 
I'll be right back and going to start another second video. But thank you for watching this video. Uh, it was the next part of the video, and I'm going to start the next one right after this one. Since this was not live, I'm just going to say thank you so much for watching. Please hit the like, subscribe, leave a comment down below. Don't forget to hit the notification bell, and I'll see you all pretty faces next time. Bye!